Hey there ladies, how we feeling? Anna Quinn from Strong Sexy Mamas here. I've got some flat tummy and pelvic floor exercises that I'm sure you're going to love. So grab a yoga mat and come on down with me. By the way, how awesome are these high-waisted or Republic tights holding everything in? Love, love, love. And my little Annabelle is here in her docker tot. Just chilling. Come on over here, Lexi. All right, so what I want you to do is come down into a baby crawling position, I'm sitting in it. So your hands are gonna be under your shoulders and your knees are gonna be under your hips. So we're gonna engage to the core, take our shoulders back and down. We're gonna inhale, exhale, and take that leg out. There is a bird, that's right, come on back in. So we're really coarsening in those abdominal muscles. Another way to think of it is wrapping it in. Inhale, exhale. Back in. These exercises are not fast, slow and steady with the race. Come on back in. And again, of course, then those abdominal muscles. Very good. So we're working our glutes here, we're working our deep corset muscles and our pelvic floor as well with that inhale and exhale. Now I do want to do some isolated pelvic floor activations. A lot of women accidentally are doing their Kegels wrong. We also like to really encourage women to relax and not just hold up and tense, tense, tense. So but the way that you can think about it is by closing and lifting from the front and the back, trying to stop the wind and the rain. I know that sounds lovely, but you close and lift. Can we do that together for five? Relax for four, relax for three, for two, for one. Relax, release, everything's gonna be softening. So we do some of these exercises in our Strong Sexy Mamas classes. I'll show you a couple of more, but you can also get in a free guide for me, 10 free flat tummy and pelvic floor exercises from Strong Sexy Mamas. So what I want you to do is long roll from your side to try to regulate that intra-abdominal pressure. Your knees are gonna be to the sky, your feet are to the floor. You have a neutral spine, so it's not arched up too much and it's not around down too much either. And we're gonna do some bent knee fall out. So we're gonna inhale, exhale. As we exhale, you bring your leg out to the side. And bring it back in. Inhale, exhale. Shake that leg out. And bring it back in. Or either side. Inhale, exhale. And come on back in. Inhale, exhale. And come on back in. So it's good to pretend like we have laser beams on our hip bones so that they're not rocking side to side. I'm going to show you one more exercise from this quadruped position. So hands under shoulders, knees under hips, shoulders back and down. We're going to do a donkey kick. We'll do two donkey kicks and then we'll do two lateral kicks, which can also be called a fire hydrant. Now we're going to switch sides. So you've got your donkey kick. It's like you're stamping your foot on the ceiling. Your foot is dorsiflexed and then out to the side. Let's do a couple more of these. So again, that donkey kick, you're coarsening in your abdominal muscles. You can inhale and then exhale on the exertion. Very good. Other side. Two donkey kicks. Squeezing that cheek at the top. And two dirty dogs out to the side. So these are the exercises that I'm doing to set a strong foundation. Obviously, we do work up and make them a lot harder. But this is where we begin in Strong Sexy Mamas after we had our little ones. My Annabelle is four months old, so I'm not doing any full sit-ups, planks, and crunches. I'm just about to start that now, but I wanted to let you know what I've been doing brick by brick, how I'm rebuilding my body so you can do this along with me. Please, please, please swipe up, swipe up, swipe up. You can grab my free guide, 10 free core restoration exercises. Those are flat tummy exercises and pelvic floor exercises. Thanks so much.